Fu Yao. Use fire. Good job. It was super effective. You miss a few hundred slithery fiends. You should stop making it rain slithery fiends in the first place. San Long is a good boy. He wouldn't do this. Stop defending him. I know you know who he is. He's a slithery fiend shield. Obviously. Hee <laughs> hee. Ban Yu, please just get one big slithery fiend to kill me next time. I'm not trying to kill you. Fu Yao, can you use fire again? I sure hail can't. Someone is restricting my powers. It's not me. I know. There's probably a sixth person. What the hail? Don't make things up. Who's there? Oh no, it's the sixth person. Ban Yu? We have to save her from the sixth person. I'll go. Wow, an actual sixth person. There is not a sixth person. Stop playing games. Ban Yu, are you still there? He's probably fighting her. Yeah, no. I think it's Pei Jr., the sixth person. What the hey made you think of Pei Jr.? I just remembered that A Zhao yelled and jumped down for no reason. He's the only other person who jumped down here willingly. How did I become more sus than this guy? That was Pei Su. What the hell? You're the one who stole Ban Yu's slithery fiends. Yup. I figured out how she controlled them. Let me kill him. You already lost 200 years ago. You only won because the gates were opened. I would have won regardless. If that's the case, why did you make Ban Yu open the gates? Some of the women and children were going to visit Yangon with explosives in hand. It was easier to kill all of them rather than capturing the radicals. What the hey? It was the perfect plot. What the hey indeed. That's a lot of dead people. Nan Feng. Are you okay? Hello, your highness. Hello, miss. Hello, Lord Windmaster. What the hey, Nan Feng? Why didn't you tell me who that was? Don't hey me. I didn't know either. Pei Su, you've been feeding tourists to ghosts for 200 years. Yes. That's a big oof for a heavenly official. I know. We'll talk later. Your Highness. Sorry about the sandy storm. It's okay. It happens. You can take Barn, you too. This is all clearly on Pei Su and Beefcake. Good to know. We can go now. I'd rather chat, but fine. Well, that solves that. Be careful. General Ming Guang is definitely going to get you back. Nah, he's not that kind of shameless. Speaking of prideful, where's Fu Yao? Wasn't he babysitting the tourists? Oh no. I forgot about the tourists. Here, let's put Ban Yu in this jar and go back to them. We're back. Here's your medicine. Yay. Thanks. Fist. I know you're a god. I won't tell though. No one would believe you anyway. When I grow up, I'll make you the biggest temple ever. Sure you will. Thanks. Relatable kid. Let's go home. I'll cook for you too, as a reward. Oh I know. Suddenly I have things to do, somewhere without a kitchen. Bye. Alright then. What would Hua Cheng like to eat? I would prefer to be called Darling Husband. <laughs>